When we're looking at vulnerability-based trust, um, the reason we focus on that so much is because we, as human beings, are automatically guarded and, and looking for danger and looking for how somebody might slight us or somebody might um, say something about what we're doing or, or have some kind of criticism that we naturally don't like. People naturally don't like to be criticized. We like to be uh, attaboyed. We like to be congratulated. We like to be cheered uh, with. But the reality is, is that when we're looking at business, most of the time we want to adjust what's not working. And so we have to look at what's not working. I have a friend who I work with um, sometimes and he's all about positivity and he's talking about all of this and he never wants to mention the things that don't work. But the reality is, is if you don't look at what doesn't work, you can't fix that. And so you can only positive your way forward so much and vulnerability based trust really is all about being able to see that whoever's in front of you is saying what they're saying because they want to see you grow and they want to see you succeed. What often I find is we don't trust ourselves to be able to either take it, take the information, or we don't trust ourselves to be able to deal with the fallout of the other person's reaction. The vulnerability-based trust is really about me as a human being being able to hear what I hear or say what I say and let things happen the way they happen and then take the next right step in the conversation instead of avoiding it or instead of uh, delegating the conversation or instead of being domineering in the conversation.